I'm sure, you know, a lot of clinicians out there have dealt with one partner in a couple being very highly emotionally charged, you know, easy to tears, easy to anger, all those sorts of things. And their complaint is that their partner just takes this intellectual approach to everything, problem solving, logical, linear, all those lovely L words that are associated with the left side of the brain, right? Um, and you can be too heavy in one direction or the other. What we're really looking for is that integration between those, those lower, more raw, primitive right parts uh, that, that drive a lot of the um, stronger emotions that can overtake us and that highly intellectual, you know, you, you think of, um, you know, people who are, um, you know, really just, uh, uh, who was the character on uh, Star Trek, Spock, you know, who was very left brain, you know, left um, uh, cortical in his, in his approach. And to be able to integrate the two, to take Spock and Kirk, I can't believe I'm talking about Star Trek, but, but to take those two and integrate them, you'd really have something. And that's what we're, we're aiming for with that emotional resilience. You have the feeling and you have the thoughts about it and you have them work together. The best way to, to think about it the, um, is imagine that, and they, they speak two different languages. Literally, one of them uses language. You know, our left hemisphere is very language dominant for most of us. And then the other uh, right part of your brain and the lower part really speaks very differently. Imagine that you have uh, someone from uh, Greece trying to negotiate with someone from China. You know, the languages, as far as I know, have almost nothing in common. And what you're needing is some place, some um, diplomat in between who can speak to both so that they can communicate and work well together. And the area that's, that seems to help in that uh, shuttle diplomacy, if you will, um, has to do with the prefrontal cortex. And um, the more you're able to engage that and your insula and all of those other parts, the better um, those two countries are going to be able to, to work together towards the greater good.